In the developing world, the burden of inadequate access to water and sanitation falls heavily on women and girls. In Sub-Saharan Africa alone, it is estimated that mothers and daughters spend 40 billion hours per year collecting water. Though I spend countless hours training in pursuit of winning Olympic gold, it isn't my only dream. I dream of a world in which women and girls have access to safe water so they can be healthy, go to school, go to work, and pursue their dreams, whatever they may be. In Sub-Saharan Africa and Asia, women walk on average 3.7 miles per day to collect water from sources that are often dirty and unsafe. Their long walks are made worse by the heavy containers of water they must carry home, which often weigh over 40 pounds when full. The time women spend collecting water for their families is time not spent at school or at work. I dream of a world in which women aren't forced to walk long distances to collect water and are able to pursue their own goals, no matter how big. I stand with USAID on World Water Day and applaud the US government's efforts to provide 10 million people with access to safe drinking water and 6 million people with access to sanitation. I stand with USAID on World Water Day and applaud the US government's efforts to ensure that women and girls throughout the developing world have access to safe drinking water and sanitation. <laughs>